What up, motherfuckers? All right, man. So once again, another patch is on us, boys. And quite frankly, it makes you wonder what the hell these dudes are doing over at church when they decide to patch and nerf stuff. I mean, they must just have a dartboard up there with a bunch of random patch notes, and they just throwing shit in all day and essentially, oh, hey, there you go, what you hit there, Ricky? Oh, today you know what we're doing? We're buffing the Vesper! Oh, shit, right on. And that's essentially what they did, guys. Yeah. They nerfed the Vesper last month, and what they do this time? Ricky there hit bullseye. Guess what? We're buffing the Vesper! So instead of aiming like your Michael J. Fox, but now it's going to be way easier. You're like Michael J. Fox, but before the Parkinson kicked in. Now they also nerfed the VMP and the CUDA, but it's, it's a nominal nerf. If you play hardcore, the one-shot kill range for the CUDA has been, you know, way increased, so it's almost impossible to one-shot kill somebody at the distance that you could before. And the conspiracy nut me, the AKA probably what is actually reality part of my brain, thinks that these patches are only here to make it seem like the game is relevant and to keep the player base coming back to try out the new patches and to try to keep their name in our mouth. And I, essentially, it's kind of coincidence, hey, this hat, or rather this patch, this hat, this hat, this patch rather, happens the day before the DLC Eclipse uh, map pack comes out. And you know what, Since essentially, if you can keep the player base interested in coming back, you know what, increase the player base, sell more fucking supply drops, and also at the same time, DLC map packs, obviously. Anyways, I mean, some of our patch notes, guys, that are kind of, you know, important is, and also at the same time, make me think, and Ricky and the retards over at Treyarch are just throwing darts at a wall and guessing, is they buffed the Argus. I mean, the Argus already was a gun of goddamn death now. I love the Argus. It's awesome if you know what you're doing, and I know what I'm doing when it comes to big guns, baby. But they've also buffed the Argus again. They've increased the one-shot kill range when you're aiming from the hip. So now, not only can you blow guys across the map, like if you're using a sniper rifle, you can just shoot guys close range of the thing. It's going to be... I imagine that thing's going to be OP as shit. They've also buffed the KRM's one-shot kill range, which is necessary. That thing only had range. like it, it Basically, if someone was close enough to piss on, then you could kill them. Other than that, you're shit out of luck. And also, the three-shot kill range of the automatic hose gun haymaker has been, you know, increased as well. And now... Some of the most also dumbest things I don't understand in this patch is they've buffed the Sheaver. Sheaver. The the Sheaver. Isn't that some isn't that some kind of thing from Game of Thrones? The Sheavers? I don't know, whatever. They've buffed the Shiva. They've in essentially increased the rapid fire rate of it. So now if you have a pussy splash and finger blast and trigger finger, it's fucking gonna be awesome for you. And you know what? I'm I'm happy they buffed the shotguns though, guys, because quite frankly, I love those and I find it hilarious now they're even more powerful. So expect to see me pooping on kids on an all day Toto DS baby on free for all games. And you know, like, this is just ridiculous, though. I don't, I don't understand what the fuck this game is doing. For me, though, like, Black Ops 3 itself is one of my favorite Call of Duties ever. And I, I essentially have played them all. I have played all the Call of Duties. I mean, there's COD 4 I love, Modern Warfare 2, World at War, Black Ops 1, and this game, and then maybe Black Ops 2 after, are my favorite Call of Duties ever. The bullshit, though, which drives me nuts is all this marketing and their scamming and their bullshit supply drop DLC nonsense. And, I mean, like, I love the game, but when I play it, it sort of makes you feel like I'm putting on a used condom. I guess that's just the way the world is going, though, guys, when it comes to business. The rich people are basically here to bend us over and rip our sphincters as much as they can and milk us for all the money they fucking possibly can get. And these patches are just are making no sense. But you know what? When you think about the conspiracy part of it, it does make sense. So anyways, I'm eight Thoughts. Thank you so much for coming by and checking out the video. You all be cool, stay in school, say no to drugs, look both ways before crossing the street, help prevent forest fires, make sure to brush and floss regularly to help promote healthy oral hygiene. And last but not least, you all stay black and don't let the honky cracker, goddamn building a moon base, reptilian shapeshifters, 9-11 was an inside job, white man, bring it down. <laughs>